8 April 2022 Morning Murli Am Shanti Baptada Madhupan Sweet children in order to make your stage form wake up early in the morning sit in solitude and think I am a soul I now have to return home this play is about to end question what does it mean to sacrifice yourself completely answer to sacrifice yourself completely means to keep your intellect and yoga in one direction neither your children nor any other bodily being should be remembered body consciousness has to be broken those who sacrifice themselves and thus we receive their inheritance from the father for 21 births those who are trapped in the name and form of one another defend their own names and the father's name question what mercy does the father bestow on all the children answer the father has the mercy of changing shells into diamonds mercy is automatically bestowed on children who take advice at every step and who don't hide anything from him song who created this play did everything himself and then hid himself away am shanti those who compose the song do not know the meaning of it the father has explained to your children look i gave you a very good inheritance when i created you heaven is the new creation the world does not know how the creation of heaven take place look how maya in the form of five vices then takes over every aspect is new for the new world no one knows what the golden age is if they do not know what the golden age is how would they know any of this this knowledge is not in any scripture the supreme father the supreme soul comes himself and gives knowledge and then this knowledge later disappears you study rajyoga but this knowledge and claim the kingdom that's all this is known as spiritual knowledge spiritual means the spirit that is the soul the father is known as the supreme spirit he is given many names people even say we want spiritual knowledge knowledge of the scriptures is known as philosophy and that can be understood by studying the scriptures the supreme father the supreme soul doesn't study the scriptures he is known as the one who is full of knowledge people think that he is the knower of the secrets within however it is not like that according to the drama they have to receive the fruit according to the type of actions they perform the philosophy of karma neutral karma and sinful karma that is when actions become neutral and then sinful has been explained to your children there are no bad actions in heaven that they would become sinful actions because the kingdom of ravan doesn't exist there this is why actions become neutral actions the effect of an action is left on a soul when he performs a sinful action it is ravan that makes you commit sin now the father explains to your children people do not know about this and so they ask how children can take birth without advice in the golden age many people say that there is definitely wise there too but not as much here too means in the world guru say that you may enlarge and wise once a year or once a month but the father instantly says children lust is the greatest enemy you have to conquer it fully become completely wiseless there is no raven there so how could there be wise 
the sick people seeing that god comes to wash the dirty clothes therefore everyone has become like dirty clothes this is not defamation of anyone they would surely be told what they are a thief would be called a thief explanations have also been given in the granth means sick scripture guru nanak prays the supreme father the supreme soul they say remember the master and you will receive happiness the father says remember me you should experience so much happiness if you find something for which you have been searching for half the cycle however it is those who continually consider themselves to be souls who experience happiness if you consider yourself to be your soul you develop love for the father at this time souls don't know who their father is those who belong to the father but do not know his occupation are called foolish they will relate the story of prallad and how god emerged from a pillar to save him but where is god people do not know god's address your children now know you are brahma kumars and kumaris the name prajapita the father of people is famous there is no wife through whom he would create children surely there must be a mouth born creation you can also explain we are brahma kumars and kumaris have you heard of prajapita brahma the father of people the supreme father the supreme soul creates creation through brahma brahma was created first and the rest of creation took place through brahma the father explains look how many of my mouth born creation there are everyone receives his inheritance from shri baba the ones that have been adopted most definitely have been poor brahma was adopted first and then the mouth born creation were created through brahma those brahmans born to wise teach physical pilgrimages whereas here you mouth born creation of brahma teach the spiritual pilgrimage even though they make effort to go to the land of nirvana none of them knows about the spiritual pilgrimage therefore the pilgrimage of their intellects is to the brahma element that is the pilgrimage to the brahma element the think that they will merge into the brahma element in that case what need is there to go on a physical pilgrimage it is shortly the pilgrimage to the land of nirvana it cannot then be said that the light merges into the light or that the bubble merges into the ocean souls make this pilgrimage they go to the brahma element this is the spiritual pilgrimage all others are those as physical pilgrimages they don't even know who will take them to the land of nirvana now the unmitted father says i take everyone back home the father becomes everyone's guide and takes everyone home there are very few human beings in the golden age all other souls definitely return home the father is the one who tells you righteous things you are now on the true pilgrimage you are souls the play is now about to end and we have to return home this should be very firm set in solitude and thinks to thoughts i am a soul baba has come to take me back home this costume is dirty talk to yourselves in this way this is known as churning the ocean the father has given you permission to perform actions but stay awake at night and practice this and it will help you to keep your state good during the day practicing at night will be useful for you during the day awaken at night after 2 am because the time between 9 and 12 is very dirty 
That is why you should churn in the morning. I am a soul. I now have to go to Baba. I will shed this costume and take another one. This is the way to talk to yourselves. 84 births have been completed and a few days remain. This is the unlimited drama. By keeping this in your intellects, the consciousness of your bodies will break. Only the Father and the inheritance will be remembered. The Father comes and teaches us. Otherwise, how could we become so elevated and pure? There is a lot of corruption now. This is why there is the committee of religious minded people. Thus things did not exist previously. This corruption etc. started now. Minister etc. accept many bribes. There is so much corruption. In the golden age, there is elevated government. You are becoming very elevated. There is no trace of sin there. The Father comes and makes us worthy of heaven. He makes all the dirty ones beautiful. He establishes heaven and grants everyone salvation. But he himself disappears. My part is to grant everyone salvation. Look what I changed the world into from what it is now. People also say that war is going to take place. Forecast that printed in the newspapers. This will happen within five years. That will happen. Acha, if destruction does take place, what would happen afterwards? Why is it going to happen? They should give a reason. You now understand that the Father is establishing heaven and that hell will definitely be destroyed. The Father comes and changes the old world and makes it new. Untimely death doesn't take place there. There is no fear of death there. They have the knowledge of souls. How each one sheds a body and takes the next. We also understand that those who come later will surely take fewer births. Our 84 births have been completed. The world does not know this. The Supreme Father, the Supreme Soul sits here and explains to your souls. The children of the father of people are brothers and sisters. Therefore, they cannot perform sinful actions. People even say that the Hindus and the Chinese are brothers. So, how can they then enlist in vice? It's very easy to say this, but they don't understand the meaning of it. The term brotherhood refers to souls. When there is the relationship of brother and sister, there will not be any vicious vision. In a worldly relationship, if someone marries a close relation, it causes an uproar. The father explains, you were deities, you were elevated, but you have now become corrupt. We are becoming elevated once again. We were elevated 16 celestial degrees pure and we then became 14 degrees. Having became corrupt, we then became even more corrupt and tamapradhan. Thus is written clearly in the scripture of the cycle. They do create a picture of the different caste, but they do not show the Brahmins as the top knot. They neither show Shababa nor the Brahmins. They show the deities, warriors, merchants, and Shudras. You now know that we are playing the game of sour salting. We Brahmins are now becoming deities. This is why we are imbibing divine virtues. We now have to return home and the whole world then becomes heaven for us. The earth will receive water. If you churn knowledge very well at night, it will help you during the day. We are now to go back with the sweet father. We have been stumbling from door to door for this, but did not find the path anywhere. Now, although you make effort to claim your inheritance, 
Maya is very powerful. She deceives you a lot. She gets hold of you by the ear or nose and you become corrupt. The intoxication of lust comes and souls are trapped in the name and form of someone like a lover and beloved. They are deceived a great deal, read, to totally defames one's name. All of this continues to happen. The father explains children stay in yoga. If good yogis do not eat for four or five days, it doesn't bother them. They still remain very happy. Your state should also be such. Check whether you have prayed for anything. Have the aim of passing fully. This is the game of each and every cycle. Keep a check on yourselves. Have I become worthy of marrying Lakshmi or Narayan? That is worthy of claiming the kingdom. If there are any defects, they should be removed. The pits will not remain hidden. Your connection is now with Shubhaba. Baba may give drishti to someone to uplift him. The father gives a lot of help, but the Brahma Kumari teacher then thinks that she did that or that she conducted the Murli very well. Such ego makes their stage fall. Good children understand that they received Baba's help. Some fall because Maya enters them. Here you have to be completely soul conscious. Your vision should not be drawn to bodies. Baba continues to give you instructions that you must continue to transform yourselves. Do not be deceived by Maya. Otherwise, you will lose your status. You remember very well the husband who gives you poison to drink, whereas you do not remember this father who gives you nectar and thereby changes you from a shell into a diamond. You should remember such a father so much. Make effort by following Srimad. If there is anything, you can ask Baba. Baba, what defects do I have? Break the consciousness of your bodies. Those who totally sacrifice themselves receive the inheritance for 21 births. To sacrifice oneself completely means that your intellect remains in only one direction. Your intellect should be removed from all those children etc. Baba says, in return for that, you will receive everything new. People say that they have had a son due to the mercy of God. Now God himself says that is temporary mercy. I now have a lot of mercy for you. You are being changed from shells into diamonds. Stay in your households but have the consciousness that everything belongs to the Father. Take Srimad at every step. The Father is the only one who gives advice. He will not allow you to perform any wrong actions. He will not allow you to give to those who enlarge and vice. Do not hide anything from the imperishable surgeon. Ask at every step. Many children do ask. Some write, Baba, these are the vices that harass me. Whereas others, even after dirtying their faces, do not tell him. If you continue to hide things, you became even uglier. Adja, to the sweetest, beloved, long lost, and now found children, love, remembrance, and good morning from the mother, the father, Baptada. The spiritual father says, Namaste to the spiritual children. The spiritual children says, Namaste and good morning to the spiritual father. Essence for the dharna. First point. In order to pass fully, remove all weaknesses and traces of vice. Do not have ego about anything. Second point. Make your vision very pure and clean. Don't become trapped in the form of any bodily being. Become 
fully soul conscious blessing may you be full of good wishes and transform anything bad and make it good with the power of silence explanation with the instruments of science they are able to transform something bad and make it good in the same way with the power of silence you have to transform bad situations or bad relationships and make them good become full of good wishes so that with your elevated thoughts you are able to transform the bad things of souls and empathy the goodness being knowledgeful it is a different matter for you to know right from wrong however it is wrong to imbibe something bad in yourself knowing it to be a bad therefore when you see something bad and know it to be bad transform it into something new slogan imbibe the quality of tolerance and heart sense cars will become serene means peaceful om shanti